Hi, I'm Brian Frank here in Tucson at the Hammer Training Camp and I'm going to show you how to use your Globus EMS device for the first time. Today we're working with Jim Bruskowitz and uh, we're going to do an active recovery routine on the quadriceps and we're going to show you how to turn the machine on, where to put the pads, connect the leads and run the program. So we've already placed the pads and we've showing you two different types. This is the traditional method a single 2x4 on each side of the here and a 2x2 two two down here. This is the uh, another option we have is the dual lead 2x4 which will still use the single lead 2x2's. Two so now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to connect the lead wires okay so now we have our lead wires connected to our pads. We have our pads placed on the quadricep muscles on the uh, lateral lateralis and the vastus medialis on both sides. And now we're going to turn the machine on. Press and hold the OK for three seconds until the screen goes black. The machine is going to turn on and spool up. And now you're ready to go. We're going to scroll down to programs training programs, active recovery, and we're going to select the upper leg, and we're ready to start the program. Now if you needed some guidance on pad placement, you can refer to our pad placement guide in the quick start manual, or right on screen you can choose electrode placement, and it'll show you exactly where to put the electrodes. So now we're going to start the program. We can set the intensity individually, on each channel one milliamp at a time or by using the up arrow we can increase all channels simultaneously in one unit increments. We're going to take Jim up to 15 milliamps and as you can see his quadriceps are starting to activate. So we're going to go ahead and increase from here. The goal that you should have is to increase the milliamps as much as is comfortable up to a maximum of 40 milliamps. So we're at 25 now. And as you can see this is a 20 minute program and we're running an 8 second loop that is doing between 1 and 8 hertz in the, in the quad muscle. And the hertz frequencies refer to the number of contractions that will occur per second. So as you can see, sometimes the muscle is twitching slowly. The 1 or 2 hertz contraction is what allows for the endorphin release. The higher frequency, the 6, 8 hertz, or contractions per second, is what helps to flush metabolic waste and byproducts out of the muscles to help reduce muscle soreness and accelerate recovery so that you can resume your training as soon as possible. And as you can see here, I've increased to 30 milliamps. Jim's getting some nice bounce out of his legs and what you're looking for is a symmetrical bounce. Now Jim's been using EMS for many years and so his muscles are very well balanced and you can see he's getting an equal amount of movement out of each. If you were to notice that for instance one leg was much less active than the other you can adjust individually each channel to bring it up until you get a symmetrical bounce out of your seven, out of each side of your leg. So we're going to go ahead and let this program run for 19 minutes. So Jim would have achieved a 40 milliamp maximum in the 28, 20 minute program and you can see it's counting down now 55 seconds left he's got at 40 milliamps he's getting a nice strong bounce now keep in mind there's no peak contractions being held here so this is not actually working the muscle this is not going to produce any muscle fatigue all we're doing is activating the muscles to help increase capillary activity or blood flow which is again going to remove metabolic waste and byproducts from the muscle and help to flush it full of fresh new blood
much like, much like a sports massage would. So that concludes our video for your first active recovery usage. Enjoy your EMS device.